Hey guys, it's Stacy here. Welcome back to my channel, Life's a Project, where I like to share my everyday life projects with you. So I'm super excited to give you an update on this project of planting annual flower seeds in containers. So all I did, starting with three packs of annual flower seeds, zinnias, marigolds, and petunias, and I just planted them in these four containers that I already had, watered them in, and just set them out and let them do their thing, and I'm really excited with the outcome, so let's take a look at how they did. So guys, look how great these look. I'm just so excited. I'm down here at my mailbox, uh, around the mailbox post area that James and I did um, over a year ago now, I think. And um, I'm just so excited for these flowers. Just a really simple and inexpensive project of just taking some seeds that um, are like a dollar to two dollars a pack and just planting them in just any old container that you have laying around and look how beautiful they turned out so beautiful and full now i originally said that i was going to thin out these containers but i didn't i just let them go and let them do their thing and they kind of thin themselves out starting with this beautiful container of marigolds so pretty i just love all the beautiful bright orange and yellow it just looks like fall to me even though it's not fall so next here I have this bucket of petunias and these are growing a little slower than the other container but you can see here there is still uh, ones about ready to open up and one here that's already opened up it looks like mostly white has bloomed in this container but it'll look really pretty probably in just a few days it'll bloom out some more and then next here one of my absolute favorites I just love this one it's so pretty these zinnias and I just love the mix of the color in here this beautiful kind of golden orange a mix of different color pinks in here just lighter pinks uh, kind of dusty rose uh, pinks more kind of a bright hot pink or fuchsia um, just so pretty there's even some white and yellow so super excited for this container. There's a lot of buds still that are ready to bloom and these all will continue to bloom until it gets really cold and you know the frost kills them out. And then next down here is the other container that I planted some more petunias in and this one has done so much better. It really has um, grown a lot faster and you can see all of the blooms here. A good mix of the white, the pink, and some purple ones are about to open up. A really beautiful dark purple. I cannot wait to see that. So really excited with how these containers are doing and I'm just really excited that I did not thin them out. I think it would have been work that really was not necessary just so really excited to know um, that you can just plant these seeds in containers and just let them go so since I'm doing an update video here's another one for you this beautiful English ivy is growing so well in here in this container that I placed down in this bird cage and that was a past project video and it is doing so good so guys, I hope you give this project a try. It really was so simple, you know, just inexpensive way to get a lot of beautiful flowers for just a few dollars, just the price of, you know, a seed packet or a few seed packets in this case, but still like pretty much six bucks got me all of these beautiful flowers that I will continue to enjoy hopefully as long as I keep on watering them and that's really all that I've done is just water these containers. And I will, I think, start to add in a water-soluble fertilizer so that these plants will continue to produce for me, continue to grow and to bloom and to be happy. And that is the key for this project, choosing plants that are fast growers, that give you the result that you want. You want blooms, you don't wanna see empty containers or just a bunch of green foliage. You want to see beautiful flowers. So guys, that is it for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. And you know, it's not too late, depending on where you 
where you live. If you have a long kind of growing season, you can go ahead and plant these flower seeds right now and you'll have a beautiful marigold, zinnias, petunias, you know, whatever you choose that are growing and you are enjoying. So if you have any questions or comments, place those down in the comment section below. And I hope you will subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on any future projects or updates to projects like this one. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.